Hello everyone and happy Sunday evening. KX Storm Team member Carolyn Gursky here and we're taking a look at our weather alerts. So we still have that wind chill warning until tomorrow at noon. So we're still looking at dangerously cold wind chills here as we head into tomorrow. Our temperatures are currently anywhere from the 10s below zero to 20 below zero. It's 11 below in Bismarck and it's 20 below in Beach. And wind chills are 30 to 40 below. It feels like 35 below in Dickinson, feels like 37 below in Minot, and feels like 43 below in Beach. And we have another cold morning ahead. So as you're head getting up and if you're heading to school, heading to work, going to be wanting to make sure that you're bundling up. We're still seeing wind chills in the 30s and 40s below. As we continue throughout the day into the evening, we're going to warm up a little bit into the 20s below zero. I know you're thinking that's not really a warm up. And as we head into Tuesday, we will be warming up with that wind chill. We even see some single digits down to the south there. So we will start to slowly warm up as we head into the week here. Winds right now are anywhere from five to let's go 15 miles an hour, mainly out of the northwest. If you look at our road conditions, we've got a lot of good winter driving, some scattered snow, and we are expecting to see blowing snow tonight and into tomorrow as well as those winds pick up something to make sure that you're staying aware of here our satellite and radar is showing quite a bit of clouds and maybe just a little bit of some light light snow flurries just south of mine out there and if we take a look at precision cast as we head into tomorrow we should be staying pretty dry however we will be seeing quite a bit of clouds and as we head into tomorrow as well we are seeing those winds start to pick up already at 1 a.m., seeing 30, 35 mile an hour wind gusts. And as we continue into Monday, by noon, we're seeing 40, 45 mile an hour winds, which is why we got another cold day ahead and we're going to have a lot of blowing snow. And I'll let you know more about that coming up on KX News at 10.